Oh my goodness gracious, it's gone, it has disappeared, someone has stolen it, oh how terrible. Patrick, what on earth is the matter, I heard some commotion in here. It has gone, some scorly wag has stolen it. What on earth are you talking about Patrick, what has disappeared? My chocolate bar, someone has come in here and stolen my chocolate, why would someone do that, that was uncalled for. Are you sure that you didn't leave it somewhere and forgot about it? Of course not, it was right here on the side, I left it here to have after I had my caviar and when I returned to the kitchen to claim it, it was gone. Now I am extremely upset, I can't believe that someone had the audacity to come in here and abduct my precious chocolate bar. Hey now take it easy Patrick, it's not the end of the world, I'm sure it's around somewhere. Hey, why don't I help you look for it? Oh, would you? Of course, what are friends for, eh? Well, okay, I suppose it would be easier to go looking for my chocolate bar instead of throwing the tantrum like Dave would do. Well, I heard that. That was really mean of you to say that about me. Why? Hey, you guys haven't seen a chocolate bar around here, have you? Sorry, but no, we haven't seen a chocolate bar around. Oh my goodness gracious. Well, did you perhaps see anyone with a chocolate bar at some point today? Sorry, but no. Why are you guys looking for a chocolate bar anyway? Well, it is my chocolate bar that we are looking for. You see, I left it in the kitchen area to have after I had my delicious caviar. And when I went to retrieve it, it was gone. And I believe that someone stole it. Well... We did see Obese Oliver go by about 10 minutes ago, and he had a chocolate bar. Obese Oliver? Oh that rascal, I bet it was him that stole my chocolate bar, the greedy garble can it. Well, I say we pay a visit to Obese Oliver and confront him about stealing your chocolate bar. Alright, now where did he go? I think he went back to his dorm room. Why thank you very much, you have been most certainly helpful. Come on Patrick, let's go and have a word with Obese Oliver. Oh man, I can't believe I found this chocolate bar lying around, and oh boy do I sure love chocolate. Anyway, it's time to eat this bad boy. Knock knock. Oh, there's somebody at the door. Welp, guess I better go and answer it before I eat this chocolate. Hello. Hello. Oh hey, Patrick and Alex, what brings you two here to my dorm room? Well... I happened to have lost a chocolate bar, I left it in the kitchen area and when I went to get it, it was gone. And both Rachel Taylor and Danny Stenner said they saw you heading here with a chocolate bar. And what is that in your hand I see, why, it's a chocolate bar, and it looks exactly like mine. I knew it, you stole my chocolate bar, you greedy gorilla. Hey! Just who do you two think you are, knocking on my door and accusing me of stealing chocolate? This chocolate bar happens to be mine, so why don't you both just get lost? Oh really? Well if the chocolate bar does indeed belong to you, then why does it have my name on it? Um, say what now? It's right there, written in black marker pen, it says this chocolate bar belongs to Patrick Walters, do not touch or eat. Oh um, well I um, oh man. Guess I didn't see the message written on the back. Well thank you so much for my chocolate bar, I hope you have learned a valuable lesson today, and that lesson is to not take things that don't belong to you. Also, don't give us that bullpup about not seeing the message written on the back, it is written in big bold letters so it would be impossible to miss. Well, I hope you have a lovely rest of your day and remember, if you want some chocolate, then please get your own instead of stealing someone else's. Thank you and have a good day. Well, bugger.